the dugong. Hi everybody, my name is Leo. I am a junior ranger. And this is my puppy, Hero. Come on in, Hero. It's really nice in here. Look, Hero, I'm a shark. <laughs> Don't worry, Hero, it's just me. I'm not a shark. <laughs> Hero, I'm really not a shark. Uh, shark, get out, Hero. I, I think that's not a shark, Hero. Phew, but what is it? You know what we should do? Let's take a photo and send it to my sister, Katie. She is also a junior ranger. Hi, Katie. We found an animal in our swimming pool. It's not a shark or a dolphin, but it's also not a whale. We don't know what it is. Hi, Leo. Hmm, I'm not sure what it is either. It has the tail of a whale. Yes, but it doesn't look like a whale. Can you find out what it is? No problem, Leo. Great, I'm coming up. Hero, you stay right here and watch our new friend. I'll be right back. Come on, everybody. Let's go into the treehouse. So did you find out what animal it is? Hi, Leo. Almost there. Our latest visitor is a dugong. It is also known as a sea cow. A sea cow? It doesn't look like a cow. It's sometimes called a sea cow because dugongs like to eat grass, just like the cows in the farm. But dugongs eat the grass in the sea. Sometimes they also eat jellyfish and shellfish. So where do dugongs come from? Dugongs can be found in the waters in the Indo-Pacific. Unfortunately, there aren't many dugongs left, so some places in the world try to protect them. Hmm, our swimming pool isn't big enough for this dugong, so we should take it to one of those places that can protect it. Come and join us. Good idea, Leo. See you downstairs. For lots of fun and lots to learn One, two, off we go For lots of fun and lots to learn Ranger, Ranger Rocky. Rocky! Hello, Junior Rangers. You have a new friend with you today? Yes, Ranger Rocky. It's a dugong. A dugong? Lucky you. These slow, shy animals are sea mammals, like whales and dolphins. That means they don't lay eggs like fish. Because they are mammals, they cannot breathe underwater like fish can. They can go six minutes without breathing, so they have to lift their noses out of the water to breathe. Dugongs live in shallow tropical waters. Sadly, they could become extinct, which means they are in danger of disappearing forever. Dugongs used to be hunted for their meat, oil, skin, and bones. Nowadays, dugongs die from being caught in shark nets or fishing nets. Their food, seagrass, is also getting destroyed by water pollution. Dugongs really need to be protected. That's why we want to take this dugong to a safe place. That's very good of you, Leo. Remember, it's best if you take the dugong to a quiet, peaceful place where there is no human activity. Good luck, Junior Rangers. Thank, Thank you, Ranger, Ranger Rocky. Rocky. Let's see what we can find. Here is a beach. There are boats with nets in the water. And over here is a nice, quiet-looking bay. Do you know where we should go? Over there is a beach and boats with nets in the water. 
And over there is a shallow, quiet bay. So where should we go? There? That's right! We need to go to the quiet bay because the dugong is safer if there are no humans. Let's go! Okay, dugong. Let's find you a safe home. We'll need to travel through these waters to reach the bay. Look, Leo. There's a boat out there. I think it's coming closer. They're coming at us fast. We'd better get out of their way. They're following us, Leo. Ranger, Ranger Rocky. Rocky! I need to warn you, Junior Rangers. I told you dugongs were hunted for their meat and oil. But I forgot to tell you that in some places, this is still happening. Even when people are not allowed to do this. So be careful. Oh no! The people on that boat must have seen our dugong and want to catch it! Leo! They're shooting at us! Oh no! They're pulling us in! Their boat is much stronger than our jeep! Hero! What's Hero doing? I think... yes! Hero is biting through the rope! Good job, Hero! We're free! Now quickly get Hero in so we can leave! I've got Hero, Leo! Okay! Everybody, sit tight! We lost them! Let's throw this net in the trash when we get home. Otherwise, animals might get stuck in it. Great idea, Leo! So what should we look for now? Hello, Junior Rangers! Ranger Rocky! To find a home for the dugong, just look in the sea for seagrass. Not for milk in a glass, or a drawing class. But look in the sea for seagrass. I see. So not for milk in a glass, or a drawing class, but, but look, look in, in the, the sea, sea for seagrass. Sea Thank you, Ranger Rocky. OK, Hero. To find a home for the dugong, you have to look in the sea for seagrass. Good luck! Hero, there are a few dots on your radar. One of them might be a place with seagrass. Should we go there? No, because there is a lot of rubbish in the water. We should look for a place that's clean. Look, there's a nice and quiet place. With the dugong like this. Hmm, I can't see any seagrass, so let's look somewhere else. So what do you think about this place? It's nice and quiet, and there is seagrass. A lot of seagrass. This will make a great home for the dugong. Good job, Hero. We're coming over. Look! There are more dugongs here. Goodbye, dugong. We did it. We found a home for the dugong. Hooray! Yay! We found a dugong in our swimming pool. We learned that dugongs are called sea cows because they love to eat seagrass. Unfortunately, there aren't many dugongs left in the world. So we took it to a safe place with plenty of seagrass. Good job, children. You did it. You are amazing wildlife rangers. Mission accomplished. 